George M. Perez. My Miami story starts in 1968 when I came from Colombia to Miami uh, to go to college. I loved um, sort of the international flavor that Miami offered. So I think that, you know, that passion for the arts developed through my mother, who was probably the most passionate person when it came to the arts and the humanities. And I always felt that I had that need to participate, you know, to allow people that did not have the same opportunities that I did to have them. There is no great city in the world without a great art museum, without a great art culture around it and institutions, cultural institutions. So Miami didn't have that. Miami was just a playground. And it was very important for us to become a serious city, you know, an urban center, which is something that I've tried to do uh, since I've been here, you know, for the arts to flourish. There's poverty and homelessness and education and transportation, and there's so many needs that particularly when the economies are not doing so well, arts philanthropy gets really cut down. So there have to be some of us that believe that the arts are just as important. You know, it's very important that we all have a sense of giving to the extent that we can to give to the community. And the Miami Foundation is that organization, right? It's the one that says, you know, we're gonna fund all these great programs, you know, and we need your money in order to be able to do it. If you don't have the money or you feel that you need to keep whatever money that you have, then you should get involved in volunteer work. To give is better than to receive is absolutely, uh, it's, it's very rewarding. 